In this video we'll demonstrate the new HTML reporting feature in Alpha Anywhere. So Alpha Anywhere has always had strong reporting but now with the HTML reporting option you can display the initial view of the reports as HTML rather than PDF. So you can see here we have a tabbed UI component that has two buttons and these buttons are both going to print the same report but the first button here is going to use the HTML version of the report so let's go ahead and click the button and there's the HTML version of the report and then I'm going to click the button a second time and, and this time I'm going to render the PDF version of the report so you can see here that in the second case this is the uh, PDF version which is the uh, the only style of reporting that was available in version 11 and prior but now with version 12 with HTML reporting you have a choice so if we look here we can see that in the case of PDF reporting the uh, tab pane here is hosting the Acrobat reader and then the PDF report is being displayed inside the Acrobat reader on the other hand if we go to the HTML report over here the Acrobat reader is not being loaded and what we see in this window over here is just the HTML version of the report and because it's just HTML it's also going to work in working preview so if I go now to working preview and display it you can see there's the report and uh, it displays in working preview as well so let's go back to design mode now and look at how we did that so you can see that we have our button in the tabbed UI that is set to print a report but a new property is now available called the initial view so the initial view for this button is PDF which of course is the only option in version 11 and prior but now with version 12 we can go and set our initial view to HTML and once you do that you get all of these additional options over here which is the HTML report viewer option so then this allows you to configure which buttons are going to be displayed on the HTML viewer toolbar and then if the uh, report happens to have bookmarks as my report does you can specify the width of the report bookmark pane so when we go back to working preview there and we preview the report you can see here because this report has bookmarks we see a pane over here that displays all the bookmarks in a tree control and I can navigate this report by clicking on items in the tree control so for example here we've set up our tree control to show all of the top level headings the group one breaks in this report and then inside each group we've displayed the first letter of the last name so for example if we scroll down to Massachusetts we can see that Massachusetts has customers that start with these various letters and if I click for example on M over there we're going to scroll the report automatically over so this here is the bookmark pane and you can configure different aspects of the bookmark pane so let's go back now to say live preview and look at our report as an HTML report so here's the report and because it's done as HTML it's not going through the Muni printer driver it's significantly faster to render than a PDF report but now that I've got the report rendered over here I can press any of these buttons so for example let's go ahead here and press the Excel button which is going to do an Ajax callback and create an Excel version of that report and let's go ahead now and open up that report in the viewer so we'll go ahead there and here's the Excel version of the report downloaded from the server and opened up on the user's local copy of Excel. Now let's pause here and pick this up in the next video. So we're continuing our discussion now on HTML reporting and we're showing here a tabbed UI component with a tab pane open that has an HTML report. We've just shown how you can click the Excel button to get an Excel version of this report now I'm going to go ahead and click the Word button to create a Microsoft Word version of this report. So let's go ahead now and click the button. That does an Ajax callback and then produces the Word version of the report. And you can see it does that very quickly because it's not going through the Muni printer driver. Alpha 5 now has a direct to Word export feature for reports that does not go through the Muni printer driver. So let's go ahead now and open this report locally and you can see here's the report opened up in Word and it's a pure Microsoft Word document so I can edit this document make edits to it 
go for example and change that to bold etc and uh, it's just a standard Microsoft Word document so let's go back now and uh, if we want to produce the PDF version of the report we again we can just go and click on the button that does an Ajax callback produces the PDF version and then downloads that and then so there's my PDF version of that same report opened up inside the Acrobat reader and uh, because this report has bookmarks you can see there's the uh, the bookmarks operating in the PDF in much the same way that it operates in the HTML report. The text button does an Ajax callback and then produces a pure text version of the report and then finally this last button is the print HTML version so this button allows you to print the report on your local printer but it does the printing as a HTML document so if I click this here you can see that we automatically bring up the the printer dialog over here but what I'm going to be printing is the pure HTML here so the pagination is going to be done by the uh, printer when each page in the printer is full it'll switch to a new page as opposed to the PDF report where the pagination is computed on the uh, server so you can see here that the HTML reporting gives you a lot of additional power by being able to create Excel, Word and plain text versions of the report, being able to print HTML versions of the report or go back and get the PDF version if you really want the PDF version and then save the local PDF file to your computer. So the big benefit of HTML reporting over PDF reporting is speed because we're not going through the Muni PDF printer driver. You can see that the reporting is done in a much, much quicker than PDF reporting. So let's just look at that again quickly. So click here to get the HTML report and you can see it's practically instantaneous. Click here to get the PDF report and there's a more of a delay because the uh, report has to be converted to PDF by going through the uh, printer driver. And then of course also the Acrobat uh, reader has to be loaded into the uh, tab pane. So I think that you'll see that uh, HTML reporting offers a lot of benefits in Alpha 5 version 12 or Alpha Anywhere. Thanks very much for watching.